So here we have an AccuCraft Tornado locomotive, live steam, gas fired and radio controlled with a TX23. Well the first thing we should do is to top up the back gas. And there's a very large gas tank down here in the tender. And I'm borrowing some gas here from my Dutch friend. There she blows, nice and full. Next we're going to fill up some water. And I use filtered rainwater. The next thing I've got to do is to top up the lubricating oil. And on this locomotive, the lubricator's here, right at the front, between the cylinders. And the first thing I've got to do is to draw out the water from the last run. And as you see, the lubricator was certainly working very well, because there's all the water from the displacement. And then to top up back again with steam oil, it's got to be proper steam oil. You can't use motor oil or anything like that, but proper steam oil. And there's five millimetres in there. Just put the cap back on again. And remember, when doing up screws, you don't do them tight. You just nip them up gently. There we go, do it up nice, not tight though, just secure. Okay, so let's fire up. We turn on the gas. Just wait for it to settle down. Not too soon or you'll get a great big flame out the front. As I said, this locomotive is radio controlled, so we turn it on. Turn the locomotive on. And if we raise the cab roof, we can see here that as we turn it, the regulator goes up and down. And deep inside there is the forward and the reverser going backwards and forwards. First we set the regulator so it's just open and it's feeding steam into the cylinders and warming them up and we put it in full reverse so when she starts creeping backwards I know she's ready to run. Just here we open the drain cocks to get rid of any water and condensate. Just started to creep, ah we're away. And we now move forward to the turntable. So here we have it. So it's going to be full forwards. Open the regulator. And away she goes. With the aid of the remote control, I'll now bring it into a halt at the station.
but after a suitable rest period, open the throttle and away she goes again. So there we have it, live steam gas fired with radio control. It really doesn't get much better than that.